We head overseas now and to Europe, into that ferocious storm hammering the UK, the Netherlands and France all right now. These pictures tonight saying it all, a crane in London, no match for hurricane strength winds, these waves slamming a commuter train. And on this quiet suburban street, a mother and daughter navigating around a giant tree toppled by the storm. ABC's Lama Hassan is in the middle of it all tonight from London. The storm named St. Jude, the patron saint of lost causes, has left a devastating mark with more than a dozen killed. In the heart of London, a crane buckling under the winds, collapsing. The building below evacuated. The deputy prime minister forced to call off a news conference. Hundreds of trees uprooted, blocking roads and railway tracks. The gas lines of this home exploding. The storm marched into northern Europe, tossing trucks and snarling trains in the Netherlands. In Germany, the famed speedy highway, the Autobahn, closed. Winds reaching 120 miles per hour in Denmark. The storm's assault of France devastated homes and ripped down power lines, leaving more than half a million people without electricity. While tonight, after the ferocious winds with gusts of up to 99 miles per hour, we're beginning to see the full extent of the damage. David.